Hey everyone, it's Nazi here, and it's time for wearing lots of brown with Nazi. Looking like a mushroom with Nazi, Nazi. Walking into walls with Nazi. Oh god, avoiding all the fire with Nazi. Can he put out the fire in third person? It's time to find out with Nazi. Oh. Oh. Yes. He did. Hey everyone, I hope you're all doing great. I'm doing fantastic. It's time to play some. Yawcraft, it's time to get our gear on, first of all, get rid of these mushroom gears, for those of you who know where this gear is from, comment section below, I'm sure all of you do, looking pretty swank, looking pretty swank in my mage gear, oh, oh yeah, oh shit, oh, oh yeah, oh, cast a spell on you mother hubbards, um, so there we are, let us get back out of that, and that, that, so, I asked you guys, in the previous video, uh, let's store some stuff first, actually. But I asked you guys in the previous video what you would like me to do, and you said, um, goggles of revealing, which is fair. Let's just put tons of stuff in Hannah's bee chest. Put these in there. Yeah, we'll put them down there. The bee, well, the beekeeping gear. Uh, yeah. So, a lot of you said goggles of revealing, so I looked up the goggles of revealing. And to make goggles are revealing, I need to first discover how to make a thumb thingy trigger. What's it called? Oh god, I don't even have the thing open. But basically, thumb, uh, thumb. Uh, what the hell is it called? I know you know. I know you know. You're sitting there thinking, "Nazi, it's very easy." Thumb, uh, thumb uh, thing. Basically that. Yeah. So to make one of them, I need to kind of research that first. Is that cooking? That, yeah, it's cooking. Right, I don't need nine in there. So I need to research how to make one of those things, which I've forgotten the name of. This is just a great start. I'm going to find the name because it's going to piss me off for the rest of the goddamn thing. Uh, thermometer. There we go. <laughs> I couldn't think of the name. Right, so I'm going to be making a thermometer, um, or at least trying to. Now, from what I understand, I need papier. I need some papier to... Um, to, to kind of research that. Now, I've got sugar canes. Let's go and harvest the sugar canes we've got outside here. Now, while I'm talking uh, about harvesting all this stuff, how are you guys doing? I hope you're all doing good. Uh, I've had a pretty good day today. I woke up pretty late. I had a crazy dream where I was like, um, we could pull, probably put some more down there. Oh, shit, spiders and shit around. I had a crazy dream Oh, where I was like, I had a car, but it was like a tractor. I uh, mean, I don't want any bother. Just go away. It was like a tractor, and I was crashing everywhere. And then I got, and then I got, I got pulled up by this judge, and then she sent me to jail. <laughs> Something like that. Anyway, uh, it was pretty. It's pretty insane. How how has your guys' day been while I make paper? You can tell me. Uh, let's see how good I do in my responses. On you go. How's your day been? Uh huh. Yeah. <laughs> Probably. Hope you don't mind me, I'm just going to put this in here. Yeah, 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 sorry. Oh. Mm hmm. Yep. Okay. Well, good. I'm glad. Well, <laughs> okay, maybe not. Um, anyway. Thanks for telling me how your day is. Thermometer, 40% complete while you were talking, just so you know. Um, uh, we need now, I've looked it up because I know you guys don't like it when I kind of, I'm too scrubby. I mean, I can be scrubby, but not too scrubby. I, I understand that. So we need some cogito, no, a cognitio. And we also need some, what do you call it? Magica. We've got magica, right? But this is what I want, stone. So that's why we've been cooking the stone up. A stone can make butans, and butans are cognitio, right? Yes, yes, I did it. Look, see, look. You believe the mystical device will point you in the direction of nearby sources of mystical energy. Well, I do. So we're sixty percent complete. So what did we need again? What was the last thing? Magic. Was it just magic? I think I've got that. I've got tons of like magic fucking things. These shards. Where where's all my shards? I've only got 
One of them. Where's my other color shards? This needs to be arranged. This needs to be organized. Is that the organize button? Default, sir. Uh, what are these? Ah, there we go. Cool. Um, so I've only got two shards in there. Okay, I've got in here. Wait, is that a brain? A brain. That's magic, right? No, that's learning. Which I've already got. I've done that. Ah, here we go. Earth shards. I knew I had a lot of one of them. Right. Earth shards. In you go. There we go. Thermometer. Motherfuckers. Are we done? Are we done? Nope. Now we're done. So we... Oh, shit. Now we took all my things there. Thermometer discovered. We need more paper for that. In fact, let's just put some paper in there. Do I not have any... I've none left. Oh, my gosh. Ah, wait, did I use all my... No, I didn't. Okay. Right, so we'll put the buttons in there. Let's bring out that. Put that in there. God, I picked up so much rubbish in that um, adventure map I did this week. Jesus. Okay, let's have a look at our discovery. You believe this mystical device will point you in the direction of nearby sources of mystical energy. Boom. Learned. Right, let's have a look. How do you make it? Because this part I haven't really looked into. What's that? Gold? Water? Gold ingots, right. The thermometer acts like a mystical compass, pointing you direction, pointing you towards the center of the nearest magical aura. You're confident you will be able to craft more refined devices in the future, allowing you to discover more information about aura notes. From now on, this will have to do. I think I've got a water shard, don't I? E yes. And I've also got gold nuggets here. Do I have gold ingots? I do! Oh my god, I've got exactly enough gold ingots! Fanta- oh, I don't- I can't make it in this, eh? It's gonna be in the magic table, isn't it? Dumbass. Sorry, everyone. Sorry. Alright, let's put it in this magic table. Dun. Hooray! Thermometer. Look at it. Look at it doing its thing. Look at this. Look at- Right. It's pointing me. It's going up. It's pointing. It looks like it's pointing up. Oh, it looks like day, day, day has dawned. How do you tell where it's fucking pointing? You can't tell. It looks like it's pointing up. It's on top of my hut. Yeah, it looks like it. Here? Yeah? The pill shack? It looks like it's pointing at the pool shack. The pool shack has tons of energy, maybe. Yeah, looks like it's above the pool shack. It must be. Yeah, it's pointing straight up. Hold on, let's dig up. I want to know what it does when you get right onto the point of, like, max, max thumb. I oh, know it's pointing down. So it's just here? It's got to be. Right, well, anyway, this looks like it's got some high vis, anyway. I think that's how that works. Let's put the, um, let's put this back together. Right, now, how do I make the goggles revealing? Good question. Because that is what I actually do want to make. I want to make the goggles revealing. Now, I've got it open somewhere in a tab. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. So it's all, oh, fuck, it's tons of stuff, you know. But it's cognitio, um, mostly. So I need more paper. Well, it's not Cognitio mostly, but it is definitely Cognitio is required to make it. So we might as well put all the rest of our paper in, which I've now put into that table, so I'm going to have to make some more. Um, but you get tons. I didn't realise how much you get. I keep forgetting you get three per um, thingy for this. All right, hopefully this will get us the coggles. Because I want to complete my set, because I think I look pretty darn cool. You know what you think? I think I look pretty cool with the goggles, and I think there's some boots. I can oh, wait, I've not got my boots on. Derp. There we go. There. So if I get goggles, it kind of completes the whole set, really, which I'd like. Um, right, let's research some paper. I could discover something else, like, completely unrelated, you know. It's pretty interesting. Or maybe I need... Well, okay, well, there goes all the paper. Um, wait, what are we doing? There. Um, okay. Maybe I need to learn some more stuff before I do that. I think that would be smart. But <laughs> I don't know what. Uh, do I have... Put that in. Oh! 
Unknown theory. Obscurus. Obscurus. What, what else has Obscurus? What did he take? Obscurus. That's Obscurus. Oh, lol. Okay. Right. Uh, think. Was a food. Have we got any more food? Wait, I've got food on my inventory, actually. Yeah. Food? No. Oh, I've got tons of steaks. Look. Ah! Victus! Life force! Da 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 da! 87 complete! 100% complete! Still no. I oh, copper transmutation! Okay. So we probably need some copper for that, right? Bronze, copper. Oh, there we go. Copper. Put some copper in here, see what happens. Ah! Yeah, have I got a new one? Yeah, metallum. Oh! What's that third one? Oh, I've got the third one! Permutatio. Of course it's permutatio because it's permutation. Right, okay. So, how do you get permutatio? Exchange, change, barter. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. What's this? Having mastered the transformation of base metals into gold, the next step would be to transform any and all metals into copper. Uh, right, what have I got with transmutatio? Um, uh, I'm liking the Stormcraft, by the way, if, in case you haven't figured that out yet. It's just cool to just put a bunch of crap in this table and then just come out with something fucking awesome, you know? What could it be that would have transmutatio? Probably something that's probably something smart that makes sense. Like uh, an oven or um, a crafting table. Maybe one of them, actually. Let me try those in a sec. I'll check all these. Oh, wait. Bronze. Bronze has it. Let's use bronze. I don't have any use for all this goddamn bronze anyway. So, fuck it. Do, 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 do. Done. 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 Oh, my God. I'm getting all the discoveries today. Uh, let's just... Can we just keep hitting that? Oh, we've no paper left. Shit, man. That's how you know it's been a good day to do research, when you run out of paper. Right, give me that. Give me all that cobblestone back. Thank you. Um, oh, wait, discovery. Okay, Whew, I'm getting ahead of myself here. Fuck, how long have you been recording for? I'm having so much fun. I've obscured my recording panel. Right, okay. Uh, we've read that. Discovered. Right, how are we doing? Okay, wow. So we're letting some pretty awesome discoveries up here. Look at this. What the fuck is that? Looks like a weird... Beastie. Is that Nitor? No, wait, that's Nitor. That's the other thing. How did I make Nitor? Fire. Ignis Lux. I wonder if I put more Lux in there, I could make the other one. I don't know what it would... I don't know how you would make it. Right. Okay, so we've made a new one up here. We got that, we got that. We're getting there. What's that? What could that be? Right. These are wands, I think. I uh, don't know what that is. What's that one? I can't see it. It's down here, I wonder. These look like golems. This could be... This looks like thermometers. I have no idea what that is. Oh my god, look at that thing. Jesus. Some cool stuff, man. There's some cool stuff to discover here. Um, oh, look at that. Silverwood trees. Cool. Look at these little lore things. Wait, Flux. Using magic is never without risks, and nothing proves this as much as Flux. If the magical aura can be described as a still pool, Flux is the ripples and eddies caused by the rock dropped into it. It is not a corruption of the magic, but a disturbance, order turning chaos and the natural laws of being on their head. Luckily, auras almost always strive for order and balance, and this usually means that Flux is purged from them in some way. The exact form this takes can vary vastly and depends on the type of flux present in the aura. The simplest and most common is the spontaneous generation of magical creatures known as wisps. Lightning strikes, storms, or mysterious illnesses or boons can all be held as examples of flux being purged from an aura. Only the brave or foolish practices magic without keeping an eye on how much flux they are letting loose into the environment. Well, <laughs> I don't think we need to worry about that, do we, folks? Let's see. I have no paper. I was going to just keep hitting that because it looks like there's some um, cool stuff. Oh, paper. Paper. Ba -da -ba -ba -da. Why do I keep making that goddamn sound? There. Bang. Oh! Oh, what? Oh, is that another transmutation? I bet you that's another transmutation. What is it? 
Having mastered the transmutation of base metals into gold, the next step would transform all metals into tin. Aha! So this is me just working out the um, the trans. Why have I got an oh red mushroom? Hello, you can stay there. I know where you're from. Uh, tin. There we go. Dun 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 dun. I wonder what other ones there's going to be. Discover that tin transmutation. Right, let's put bronze back in there. There's probably going to be some more. Yep, there is. Yep. Uh, 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 uh. Is that done? Yep. Oh, wait. Nope. Nope. There. Uh, iron. Okay. Have I got any iron? Yep. Nope. Tin. Damn it. Um, do I have iron? Lead. Tin. I don't have iron. Shit. The one thing I should have. Put that bronze away. Put that copper away. Put that tin away. Put all this junk away, actually. Jesus. What is that? Basalt cobblestone. Where the fuck did I get that? Um, what have I got in here? Tin? Uh, iron, even? No iron? Son of a bitch. What oh, damn. How do I not have iron? That's embarrassing, kind of. Tin, tin, tin ingot. Uh, I need one for transmuting diamonds. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Right, okay. It looks like we're going on the hunt for bronze, which seems to be incredibly useful. And tin. Oh, a diamond sword. That's from that adventure map I did. Right, so let us go a mining. We've not got long left, so we'll just go mining for the end. And we'll see what we can dig up. So it's been a pretty, it's been a bit of a bottle episode today. I haven't really done much exploring. But that's mostly because I've just been discovering stuff, you know, getting the groundwork done on, uh on magics. Oh, I've got a question for you all. A lot of you really enjoyed the, um, a lot of you enjoyed the fishing stuff I did. Fishing to the, fishing to the limit with Nalzi. Do you remember? I did that video where I just sat and fished and had a chat for like 20 minutes and then tried to catch a cat and failed badly because I did it wrong. Well, I'm quite up for doing that again. You know, just make sure I've got that checkpointed. Uh, you know, I'm quite happy to do like more of that kind of stuff. So it's up to you. Comment section below. If you want me to do more just like chatty fish fishing videos, I'm happy to do that because literally I need to sit down and do it and it makes me feel like I'm more productive if I'm recording it because then it's actually like stuff where I can put that out in the channel and it's nice. So, But it's up to you guys if you're not interested in seeing it. I'm going to this cave thingy by the way if you're wondering. If you guys are not interested in seeing it then I won't do it but hopefully you will be. So if you want to see more fishing to the limits with Nalzi then um, comment below saying uh, I don't know give us more fishing or fish more. Fish. I love fish. I'm just having a look across the plains there. Not much going on. Right so we're on the hunt for iron and bronze. What the fuck? Where's the door to this goddamn cave? Here. Wow, good, great job here, Nalzi. <sighs> a mining we shall go. Bumping our head every step of the way. What is that? Copper, right. We'll just see if we're getting all the ores we can, really. So I could be here a while. To get used to it, folks. There we go. God, I watched a great movie last night. Uh, no spoilers if people haven't seen it in the comment section. I'm watching you folks. But the movie's called... Um, is this gold? What is this? Yeah, cool. Uh, the movie's called The Game. It's like an old movie, 1997 or something. Um, Michael Douglas movie. Great movie. Uh, it was really... It's one of those movies that you usually see on TV and you're like, oh, I'll watch that at some point. But you never really get around to it. And uh, I, had, I hadn't even heard of the movie, you know, but it was really, really great. So if you're a movie watcher, you like your, you like your movies, uh, check it out. It's on Netflix, so you can go watch it and um, you'll have a great time. You'll have a great time. Oh man, fucking tons of iron here, by the way, in case you're not watching this uh, iron situation that's going on. Should I just go now? I could just go. What's that? Silver? I think it is, you know. Yeah, silver. I could use that. I might need that, you know. If I get like a silver transmutation thing. So that's what I'm kind of thinking here. Plus silver is a good material to have. Fuck, I'm caught in cobwebs. Die. Right. right. Let's just see what's across here. Then we'll then we'll, we'll haul ass out of here. 
more iron. Which I guess we need since we seem to be low on it. Here's a question. See, um, or does it repopulate? Like, let's say I have dug out these blocks. I don't think it does. This would be a dumb, this is actually a really dumb question, I think. But like, don't you think it should? No, that's dumb because rocks wouldn't just form. Basically, what I'm saying is if you're in a tunnel, right, and I dig all of this stuff and now there's no ores left, blocks should then start becoming ore if I come back in a few days. But, I mean, it's dumb. I mean, that's a dumb thing to say, isn't it? Because that wouldn't ever happen IRL. But, you know, it's not IRL, it's Minecraft. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. Something down there. Something bad. That's what I wanted a torch, so I can actually see him. Right, you son of a bitch. Suck it. I'm going to take all your ore, taking all your experience. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Thalmometer's going mad. Whoa. Was it? No, it's not. I thought it was, but it's not. Um, that's another question for you. A lot of people were saying, oh, I should save up my levels for when I get to, like, level 20, uh, 32 or something like that uh, so I can enchant my gear. Uh, how do you know what to enchant gear? Because from what I understand, it's all fucking gobbledygook. It's all, like crap letters and you can't make sense of it so I don't know how I'm supposed to know what the hell I'm doing with my chat oh is this where I forgot those diamonds it is look everyone I've returned to the diamond place I'm getting the diamonds now look not a noob well I am still a noob but slightly less of one it's careful there let's get this redstone because it's very good for um researching from what I understand it's uh it's like it's got mach uh, machina or something machina however you want to pronounce it tons of ores here let's just pick them all up that one's gonna leak lava isn't it shit I've ran out of room let's get this I'm very very cautious that we're in very near lava. Remember, I don't know if you guys remember. In fact, comment section if you do remember, because you you must be or have been around for quite a while if you do remember. But like, do you remember in Hannah's video where like I was mining and then a zombie came up from behind and punched me into lava and I lost all of my gear? Like that still scares me to this day. Where I'm kind of like shit. I I want to be very careful around lava because I don't want no zombies to just like falcon punch me into um, death, which is what they do. Let's get rid of something um, so I can make room for bones. Get rid of bones. Uh, Ender pearl. We'll keep that for now. Sugar cane. We'll keep that for now. String. Sorry about the dogs barking. It's the neighbors, I think. Let's um, let's get rid of the sugar cane. I guess we don't really need that. Uh, we'll get this. Get this. Look. Look at this. Huh? Who's this Nazi? Pro at Minecraft, surely. Look at that. Done, you know? Done. Alright, I'd like to get a bit more of that ore. Oh, there's some over here too, actually. What is this stuff, anyway? Just Nicolite? I wonder if Nicolite can research and things. See, the researching, I don't know, it reminds me of, um... Yeah, it is Nicolite. It reminds I don't know what it reminds me of. It, I feel like it used to be a game I used to play or something like that, or... I don't really... I don't really remember, but it's... Like, it's just the idea of putting tons of stuff in a big chest and then research and uh, I don't know it's, it really gets me going you know maybe not you but definitely me I'm gonna go over and get that uh, water shards there which are good plus who needs this big lava pool anyway there's also some redstone here which is very useful for research and also for amazing oh I forgot to show you guys right I'm gonna show you guys stick around before the end of the video Duncan visited my base, um, and I'll tell you why. Because I like to be up up front with you folks. Once I get this, hold on. Look at this. I oh, should need a bit more cobblestone. Do I have any? Flipping Nora! I actually have to mine cobblestone. <sighs> right. Let's do this. Oh. Right. Let's get that. Right. Anyway, where was I? I want to go over there now. So yeah, Duncan visited my base. 
because I, w I had an idea for my gear, you know, how I've got the thumb stuff. Well, I, I was essentially got him to redesign it because, you know, Duncan has like an art degree and stuff and he's really good at the textures in Minecraft and that. And uh, I wanted my texture in Minecraft to be my character with robes on rather than my character with silly things. So as you can see, the robes are actually with my stuff behind it, you see? See, so it's got like my shirt and my trousers there. The shoes need some work. We didn't think about that. But it's the but if you look there, see without the shoes, the trousers and the robes. So it's it's quite, it's quite nice. So he came over and while he was over, he fixed my uh, oh, 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 oh he fixed my machine. Do you remember the machine I wanted to build? Like not one, not a machine, but do you remember when I said I wanted the um, God, what was it? I wanted there to be like a secret room that no one could get into but me who knew where the lever was needed to be placed and I made a complete pig's ear of it. Well, he came over and I was like, hey, Duncan, check out my amazing new machine. And he was like, what the fuck is this? And I was like, it's my <laughs> amazing machine that doesn't work. And then he fixed it. So I'll show you guys that before we finish. I want to get that iron up here and then I'll go. Iron and then I'll go. I'm desperate for the old irons, you know? Mmm, delicious iron. Tons of it. Well, not really tons, but, but you know, oh, there's some more over here. It's dark over here, though, I've got to be careful. Care bot lane monsters. Yes, I play Dota. Not a lot anymore, though. I used to play a hell of a lot, too much. But it destroyed my soul, so now I don't play it. The story of every fucking player of Dota's life. Right, I think I could just, instead of going all the way back, I think I can just do this. Waypoints base teleport ah! okay How the, uh, suck it there you go who the fuck let that bastard in i honestly thought that was duncan or something there for a second i was like oh hi duncan <laughs> nope the door's closed so right whatever right so here's what duncan did as you can see Boop. he fixed it he made it work i don't know how I don't have any idea what any of that is, but he did it. So what I'm going to do is, like, back here, have, like, a weapons place, like, to keep all my weapons so I can get ammo for my gun. Do you remember I've got a gun? I've got a handgun. Uh, so, yeah, I might do that. And now I need to smelt this iron, right? I'll smelt this iron. Oh, whoops. Fucking dogs. My God. If you can't hear those dogs, be thankful. They're assholes. Um, right, just just the one, just the just the one. There we go. Right, and then we need. Oh wait, what? Um, guys, I didn't notice that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. How? Why would it? I'm sorry. <laughs> Don't be angry. Have you mastered? Yeah, yeah, it's iron, right? Okay. I'm. So... How would I have known that? At least we got more materials away. Right, guys? Let's put some more bronze in here. Why would it not need iron, though? That's strange. It's another transmutation. Which one? I want to get all the transmutations out of the way. I like this. Come on. Come on! Oh, come on! You fucking tell me I need more bronze? I don't have any more bronze. I didn't pick up any either. How do you make bronze? Is it like copper? Copper and tin? Is that right? Is it copper and tin? Is that the right thing? Fucking dogs. Bark, bark, bark. Suck my dick. Bro oh my god. Okay. Bronze, bronze, bronze. Smelt, bronze, bronze, bronze. Right. Well, we can't do that one for now then. We need more bronze, apparently. Now we don't have any. Well, there you go. Oh, it's silver transmutation. Well, we're so close to having it finished as well. We just need a bit more bronze. I thought it was just a copper and tin to make bronze. What, what's that? Copper. Damn it. But it's not, because that would be smart, I guess. Yeah. Okay. Right. Well, I'm going to wrap it up here then, folks. Sorry, but I took you on that little excursion to get more iron that we didn't really need, but fuck it, you know. Uh, I'm going to clean up my inventory a little bit here because it's a goddamn mess. And I'll catch you all later. Okay, so I'll see you all next time where we're going to finish off this transmutation here. I'll, I'll go and get more bronze off camera to kind of speed up for you all. And 
hopefully we'll try and get the, the goggles. You can leave suggestions below for what you'd like me to do next, but it's up to you. All right. So, again, comment below. What should I do next week? Oh, fuck. What should I do next week in terms of discoveries? Or what should I try and get? And, um, yeah, if you enjoyed the video, click like. And if you want to see more, comment, favorite, share. And that'd be fantastic. So it's goodbye from me. It's good from my, goodbye from those dogs that are barking, which you may or may not be able to hear. And I'll see you later. Bye. This is my outro song, so that the vid doesn't end too hoo suddenly. Be sure to click like and fave and drop a comment if you think that you want to. Oh, oh, and there's tons of other stuff for you to click in the in the background for you. So go out, go ahead and do that. Thanks for watching the vid, you hooty foo people. That is all for now, be sure to subscribe and I'll catch you all later. Oh god. Bye. Seriously, why are you still watching this? Go and subscribe and drop a comment below. God damn you, stop watching video. Click fave, drop a comment, I think you want to, but if you don't, well that's your opinion, I guess.